Good morning, Ray Panthers. If you have not yet started your day today, you are now tardy. T-A-R-D-Y, tardy. We are creating a clear path to success, and we are taking care of business every day. Excellence matters. This is how we do it at Wright Middle School because we are in it to win it. Let's show everyone how Wright Panthers are caring, respectful, understanding, zealous, and awesome learners. Let's remember to respect, support, and encourage everyone. It is now time for our patriotic observance. We live in a nation of freedom. Participation in the pledge is voluntary. Those of you wishing to participate in the pledge may stand. Others may remain seated. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Announcements for today. Today is a stupendous day. Today is a stupendous day. Today I'm giving a shout out to Jordan Brown and Janaya Richardson who have been selected as our eighth grade Martin Luther King Jr. Outstanding Young Person recipients. This award is given out by the Urban League of Greater Madison to celebrate the achievements of outstanding young people in, the Dane, in Dane County in honor of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. It is a very prestigious award as only two students per grade level per year are nominated. Keep utilizing your brilliance in ways that matter, scholars. At right where scholars focus on high achievement and excellence, if you believe it, you can achieve each morning. I want you to affirm yourself by saying after me, I can learn anything. I can know anything. I can be anything. The mission of the James E. Wright community is committed to do whatever it takes every day to ensure that every scholar achieves high levels, develops self-efficacy, and becomes community, college, and career ready. Let's stay engaged, build meaningful and authentic relationships with one another, and learn all that we can. And have a tactful Tuesday. Right, Panthers. Have a great day or not. The choice is yours. Just a reminder, scholars, to be organized, focus and work hard, be patient, respectful, supportive, and communicate. Be understanding and expect greatness. But most importantly, be your best self and have fun. Just a reminder, scholars, to be respectful, kind, and loving to yourselves as well as to each other. And have a great day. Christmas. Christmas is celebrated on December 25th and is both a sacred religious holiday and a worldwide cultural and commercial, no, commercial phenomenon. For two millennia, people around the world have been observing it with traditions and practices that are both religious and secular in nature. Christians celebrate Christmas Day as the anniversary of the birth of Jesus of Nazareth, a spiritual leader whose teachings form the basis of their religion Popular customs include exchanging gifts, decorating Christmas trees, attending church, sharing meals and f with family and friends, and of course, waiting for Santa Claus to arrive. December 25th, Christmas Day, has been a federal holiday in the United States since 1870. In the early years of Christianity, Easter was the main holiday. The birth of Jesus was not celebrated. In the fourth century, church officials decided to institute the birth of Jesus as a holiday. Unfortunately, the Bible does not mention date, the date for his birth, a fact Puritans later pointed out in order to deny the legitimacy of the celebration. Although some evidence suggests that his birth may have occurred in the spring, why would shepherds be hurting in the middle of the winter? Pope Julius I chose December 25th. It is commonly believed that the church chose this date in an effort to adopt and absorb the traditions of the pagan Saturnia, Saturnalia festival, first called the Feast of the Nativity. The custom spread to Egypt by 432 and to England by the end of the sixth century. Have a great day.